Here is a on tablet. This is a third generation. This is the eight inch, but this should work for other mo other models as well. But basically, you have a black screen. Even though you have a black screen, you know that it's still on. Maybe you can hear notifications coming in, or just to make sure that your um, tablet is on, even though the black screen is here, what you can do is you can go ahead and plug it in. Okay, so give it a little bit of battery juice. It doesn't matter if you have the volume on mute or not. Okay, just plug it in. Wait. And that ding, you can hear that, okay? So then you know that the uh, tablet is at least on, okay? Now this screen here is fixed, but we're gonna pretend we have a black screen here. I'm gonna give you guys several steps that you can do right now at your home. Nothing to do with taking uh, the tablet apart or anything. If you guys follow all the steps, at least, I'm gonna say 70, uh, at least 70% of you guys should have a working screen if you do every single step, okay? Or if you try every single step, okay? So the first thing is this, if you have a, case on here or anything like that take it off okay we want to bare bones naked okay and the first thing we're going to do is we're going to restart it using only the power button okay so let's just pretend my screen here is black okay so you have the power button right here just press and hold the power button don't let go until you see the on logo appear okay so we'll do it together power buttons right here ready set go press and hold don't worry about what's happening to the screen let's pretend it's black i don't know what's going on here i'm just holding on to that power button waiting for an on logo to appear still holding the tablet just turned off. I'm still holding. It's going to turn on. It turned on. Now I let go of the power button, let it boot up normally, and hopefully you are out of the black screen. If not, we're going to go to step number two. So if you still have a black screen, no problem. Next thing we're going to do is this, okay? First, locate your power button, okay? What I want you to do is just press it kind of hard three, uh, three times, okay? No more than three times because some of you guys have the SOS enabled. So if you press this like four times, it's gonna call, it's gonna call emergency line. Like here in the US, it would call uh, 911. So here's the power button here. Just press it three times. One, two, three, kind of hard, just like that. Now, we're gonna go ahead and plug it in, plug it in, give it a little bit of juice. All right? Let's pretend my screen here is black. And now while it's plugged in, charging, we're going to press and hold that power button again until we see the on logo appear, okay? We'll do it together. Power button right here. Ready, set, go. Press and hold. Keep on holding. Pretend my screen here is black. I have no idea what's going on. I'm just holding onto this power button, hoping a on logo appears. Still holding the power button. Still holding up. Oh, there's the on logo. Go ahead and let go and let it boot up normally. You can go ahead and unplug it. And hopefully you're up and running now. If not, then we're gonna, gonna we're gonna go to um, possible step number three. All right, so you still have a black screen, no problem. Next thing we're gonna do here is what I call the tap method. What I want you to do is I want you to hold the tablet like this. And we're gonna grab two fingers, and what we're gonna do is tap all over on the screen and all over on the back, okay? And you kinda wanna do this kinda hard. And the whole premise behind this is it's very likely you may have a ribbon that's slightly dislodged, slightly disconnected, and a little tap can pop it into place, believe it or not. Okay, anyway, right here, we're gonna start on the screen here. It doesn't matter if you, you do it on the screen or the back first, but we're gonna tap kind of hard here. And as you're doing this, sometimes you get half a screen, maybe you'll get some white lines, but just keep on going. Uh, okay, still black, no problem. Turn it over, do the same thing on the back side, okay? Gotta hit it kind of hard, okay? All over, okay? Camera lens, get all around there okay if you don't want to smudge it up you can use like a cloth or something to cover that up but nice and hard all over turn it over tap on that power button and see if your screen is on okay if it's still black no pro no problem from here do the same thing power button press and hold ready to go press and hold don't let go until we see that on logo appear okay still holding pretend my screen here is still black Still holding onto the power button. Tablet just turned off. It's gonna turn back on. There's the on logo. Let go of that power button. Let it boot up and hopefully now you're out of the black screen. If not, we're gonna to go to the next possible fix. All right, so you still have a black screen, no problem. Next thing we're gonna to going to do next is what I call the mas massage method. What we're gonna do is massage the screen as well as the back. We're gonna get two thumbs and we're gonna press, we're gonna hold the tablet like this, okay? And there's a whole premise behind the tapping as well. You probably have, it's very likely you have a cable that's slightly dislodged. And a little press can pop it into place, believe it or not, okay? Anyway, if you don't wanna smudge up your screen, you can use a cloth or something like that. But it doesn't matter what side you start off on, but we'll start off on the screen here. Pretend my screen here is black. You're just gonna press all over, give it a nice massage, okay? And the same thing, um, sometimes you're doing this, the screen might pop on, 
you might get half a screen, you might get white lines. Let's press, press, press. Okay, press, press. And then, okay, screen's not on. Tap the power button and see if the screen is on. Okay, if not, no problem. Then we're gonna go to the back here. We're gonna grab our thumb and we're gonna press, press, press. Now, if you hear a little click, turn the tablet over and tap that power button and see if your screen is on. Okay, if not, no problem. Press, press, all over. Press kind of hard, okay? Even all around the lenses here, press, press, all right? Turn it over, tap that power button, and see if it, the screen is on. If it's still black, no problem. Again, press and hold that power button. Ready, set, go. Press and hold. Keep on holding. Do not let go until we see an on logo appear, okay? So I'm still holding here. Power button. Tablet just turned off. It's going to turn back on. There's the on logo. Let go of that power button and let it boot up normally, and hopefully your screen is now working. If not, we're going to go to the next method. Now, the next method here is what I call the smack method. Same premise behind the uh, the tapping as well as the massage, okay? Except this one here, we're going to smack. So what we're going to do is hold your hand like that. You can put a cloth on there if you wish. What we're going to do is we're going to smack the screen, the bottom of the screen, and on the back, okay? So it doesn't matter what side you start off on. I just start off on the screen side here, and I give a couple of whacks right here. The bottom of the screen. All right. Tap that power button and see if the screen is on. If it's off still, no problem. Now we're going to go ahead and smack the back of the tablet. Give it a nice couple of whacks. The bottom of the back as well. Then tap that power button and see if the screen is on. If the screen is still black, no problem. Again, power button, press and hold. Do not let go until you see the on logo appear. Once the on logo appears, let go of that power button, okay? And hopefully you're up and running now. If not, go on to the next step. All right, so you went through all the steps and your screen is still black. So the next thing I have for you is this, okay? Now, if you have a screen protector on here, you may want to go ahead and take that off, okay? If you don't, no problem. Grab your tablet just like this, naked, go to your freezer, put it into your freezer where it's nice and cold. Leave it there for about 15 to 20 minutes. After 15 to 20 minutes, Go to your freezer, take out your nice cold tablet, tap that power button, and see if your screen is on. If it's still black, then same thing. Press and hold that power button. Don't let go until you see the on logo appear. Once it appears, let go. And hopefully, you are now up and running. Now, if this didn't work for you, then what I would recommend is starting from step one again. Do every single step. Try to do it every single step at least seven times. A lot of times, the seventh time is a charm. If you guys tried it seven times and it's still not working, then what I would do next is I would try to wipe the cache partition or just do a factory reset, a hard reset, okay? Anyway, if this worked for you, uh, please uh, thumbs up and comment which step you think worked for you, okay? Good luck, guys.